a traditional Kazakh instrument. Uh -huh. Yeah, so it's, it's a two strings uh, lute instrument, as you can see. Similar to other string instruments like ukulele or guitar, ukulele. and uh, dobra is uh, essential for every Kazakh family. You can, mm. As long as you visit any Kazakh family, there must be a dobra hanging somewhere mm. prominently. You know, there is like a, a symbol. symbol of, as you mentioned, yeah, uh, there's a symbol of a oh. falcon representing ah, yeah. one of the greatest Kazakh dobra player in northern Xinjiang, and uh, he passed away last year, and this is uh, in honor of him. Mm. Yeah. Cool. Awesome. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, uh, okay. Uh, uh, we can actually link after this uh, the. Yeah, the, sure. The, the, I, I, I will include this clip uh, in our blog and. And then uh, see. we, on behalf of my wife and of course Malaysian, we are yeah. very thankful because yeah. uh, this is. For, the, for bri providing us the very nice room and. So warm hospitality. Uh, I don't know. It's I, I guess um, it's it's we are lucky to meet you in here in Xinjiang. Likewise, actually, and I, uh, we, we learned a lot. Uh, <laughs> and, and, and as I mentioned to him uh, before, he is a walking Wikipedia. You can ask everything about China, <laughs> about Xinjiang, or, about I mean, Kazakh, and even like in, in the house we can ask openly. So he can uh, uh, elaborate in details and in fact uh, go back to the histories. Yeah. And I, I believe this is the, the, the cow surfing is all about yeah. uh, learning is big fan, big fan. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So now we are going to the airport and goodbye, Wumchi. Goodbye. Yeah. Goodbye, Wumchi. Have fun. <laughs> yeah.